y'all welcome to my channel if you are new here thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to watch one of my videos and if you are returning for your second third fourth fifth sixth or many more times thank you so much as well for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to come on back and watch yet again another one of my videos so in today's video, I have a little Burlington haul for you guys, and then yet again we went to the flea markets and we got some good stuff today. So my mom got a lot of good stuff. I wish I like I wish I could show you some of what she got. I should have, I was going to honestly like film some of the stuff that she got before I came home um, to show you guys, but I just honestly didn't get a chance to. By the way, for those of you that had asked me previously, the interview went well. Um, so I'm in the next process for the interview, so I'm super excited, so fingers crossed. All right, let's get into it. We're gonna start with the Burlington Hall. Um, there's not a whole lot from there, but there's some really cute stuff. So let me just start with this bag because I want to take it back inside so my cats don't destroy it. Let me grab it. So I bought this gorgeous, it's literally styrofoam though. That's the only thing that kind of scares me about this. And it was a little bit pricey in my opinion. It was $14.99. Um, no, that's not the right one. $14.99. But look at how pretty this reindeer is. It's just so gorgeous. I just loved it. And they only had one left. But I just thought it was so beautiful. So, to go along with the little reindeer. And this one was $10. They actually had a lot of these. Um, they had some like green and gold ones. They had this big beautiful gold one that I wanted to get for my mother, but um, I just didn't have that much money right now. So um, so I bought these two. This one was $10. Some of them were $6.99. Some of them were $10. Some of them were $15. It just depends, I guess, on the size and whatnot. So, But look at how pretty that is going to look together. Like the little sequence horse and the beautiful sequence tree. I just love these. I think they are so gorgeous. My cats are out here again being a little pain in the you know what. So I want to show you guys that because I am going to pause this in a minute and go put these away because I do not want my cats to touch this. And I'm super worried about the styrofoam reindeer, honestly, because I don't want it to break. Sorry. Literally just had to yell at my cat. Alright, so I kind of showed you guys in the last video a sneak peek of some of the stuff I had in my cart from Burlington. But this is the one that I ended up going with. So I did get this little gift set. And I don't quite know if I want to keep it for myself or give it to my daughter. I don't know if she's going to like this or not for Christmas, but it is just so cute. And it was only 25 bucks, which isn't bad at all. So it's got the little juicy purse, the little handle, the big handle, and I love the material of this. It's actually pretty nicely sized inside. And let me see. And there's the zipper pouch and there is a packet in the front as well. So I went with the pink one. I liked the black one, but I was like, you know what, I have so many black purses, honestly, so I decided to go with the pink one. And if, if I do decide to give it to my daughter for Christmas, she loves pink, so. And it comes with this little heart, little keychain, um, like, I don't know, I guess a change purse. You can put your change in there. I don't know what else you could really put in there. I don't know, some mints or something. I don't know. <laughs> but this is the one I ended up getting. Super duper cute. I thought about getting both. I really did. They were only 25 bucks, which I did not find bad at all. And the they, it was the last one of the black and the pink. 
But I just got the pink one because I wanted the other bag that I'm going to show you guys as well. So I did get some really cute undies, which I will show you guys. Uh-oh, one of them fell out. So these ones are just like so comfortable. Little comfy thongs. So there's a black, uh, like beige or nude color, a hot pink, and then this purple color. Super comfortable, super cute. Then I bought these ones. Oh, and those ones were $7.99 for four pairs. Not bad at all. Eight bucks, two bucks each. <clears throat> And I got these ones. These are so, so adorable. And these were only $5.99 for three pairs. And again, so you got the pink with the roses and the little heart, um, little gem on there. And the lace. And they're so cute. Then you just got all pink. And they all have the little heart gem. And then you got the nude beige color one. So, really cute. That is what the backs look like. They're kind of like the booty short kind of thongs. Super cute. And then these are the last ones I got because I just thought they were so pretty as well. So there's pink. Then this is actually like a light pink. There's hot pink, light pink, and then there is black. And this one was, you know what the tag was like cut off on this one? It was like kind of in half, but I think, I want to say these ones were $5.99 as well, maybe $6.99. So, I don't know why, but the tag was like basically cut in half when I took it to the register, but it was still on there, so. Um, but I don't know where it went. It obviously fell off somewhere, but yeah. So, I think they were, I want to say $6.99, but they could have been $5.99, they could have been $4.99, but how cute. So those are those. <clears throat> then this is the other one I decided to go with. And this one I had so much trouble with because I loved this one and the pink one. Um, and it was literally the last two left again. So this was $20. So I ended up going with the um, neutral color. The tan, beige, whatever you want to call this color. I don't even really know. Cream? I like cream. <laughs> so, it's just super small little purse, but it does have a zipper pouch in the back. And a pocket in the front as well. And this says juicy. I thought this would be so cute for when we go to the casino or whatnot. It's got the long strap and the little handle strap. And it's just so perfect and little. And I love the color because, like I said, it does it matches pretty much everything so that's why I want with the cream color plus I got the other one in the pink color so and I knew I wanted this one but I did love the pink one as well they were both so cute and then the last but finally not least from Burlington I got these they are freaking gorgeous you guys I absolutely love these like they are just so so pretty and so cute and they were only 20 bucks as well so they have all the they're just black kind of high heels with the square toe and then all the rope uh, rhinestone design on it and then the rhinestone design on the back and then this goes around your ankle so and these are seven and a half, and they were $20. But how freaking cute are these? I love them. I almost bought two pairs and bought one for my daughter as well because she told me to like look for her for um, Christmas for super cute high heels, and I just thought these were adorable. <clears throat> but I'm like, in all honesty, I probably really won't wear them that much, but I had to have them because I love them. So... I figured I could be nice and she could share with me if she wants them. By the way, I decided to give my nails a little break. I polished them yesterday. However, I used this 
um, gel clear coat and it just was not drying at all and it made them all like bubbly and horrible so I repolished them twice and I didn't I guess didn't realize that it was from that and I was so angry so I just didn't feel like doing it again and I tried just putting on a regular top coat over it but it it didn't help so I gotta take them off and repolish them but I do love this color it's a really really pretty color but you could probably honestly if I put them closer which I don't want to you could probably see all the the bubbles and chunkiness and whatnot okay unfortunately that's all from Burlington but stick around because we got lots of goodies from the flea market today we got a ton of stuff for free and you know of course some we paid for but we got a lot a lot of stuff for free so all right let's just start with the boring stuff so i got a broom we needed a broom for our garage because i'm always taking our house broom out there and i don't like using our house broom for my garage so i just got this for a dollar fifty and then i also bought set that over there then I also bought the little this little dustpan to go with it they didn't have any just like I just wanted like a regular dustpan honestly to like go on the broom but I said this will work I guess so I got this little pink one they had pink um I want to say pink blue or green maybe I think so I just went with the pink I didn't really care so I was like it's just going in my garage and it's just gonna be a dustpan so I did get that as well with it all right let's move on so these my mother gave me to start she got this little cute little adorable little like jungle set up in her house in her living room she's got like this big like um, china hutch cabinet and then she's got like the counter space and she's got all these little like knickknacks on there and it's like a big jungle it's really cute but she had too much stuff so she gave me the little giraffe and the little cute little kitties i really don't know if i even i'm gonna keep these or not but i said uh, i'll take them for now and decide what I want to do with them. Alright. Next, I just bought this hand towel for a dollar. It's just a white checker hand towel, but it's really big. That was only a buck, so it looked pretty much brand new, honestly. So I figured for one of the either the kids or our bathroom, like I said, it's just white, so it'll match anything. So I bought that. Get down. Get down. No. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> this is just my sweater because it was actually a little chilly this morning. And I got this book bag for my daughter because it looked really, really big and I actually really liked it. And she's like, it's like, how much for the book bag? And she said two bucks. I didn't really realize it has a little bit of staining on the bottom, but... I thought for college it was cute and like I said it's really really big and it's got a lot of compartments and spaces <coughs> it is a Northfield book bag so for two bucks I figured why not I scared my cats one second guys sorry I had to pause it for a second because my cats are being little rug rats again so this my mom really liked and I mean it's beautiful but I can't wear fake jewelry honestly so she said it could be an anklet or a bracelet and I have another thing is I have super small wrists so even at the tightest setting it's still pretty big on me but look at how gorgeous this is and my mother loved it so I bought it for her for Christmas isn't that just beautiful like all the rhinestones and the double heart it was a little bit expensive I think it was ten dollars I can't remember if I asked for eight on it 
or if I just paid it because we had gotten other stuff that she gave us deals on. But how freaking beautiful is that? So pretty. So I bought that for my mom as a Christmas gift. She knows what it is. She already saw it, but that's okay. I got a bunch of brand new bags of candy. I already jumped into them, but I have been on a Butterfingers and a Milky Way kick lately. I don't know why, but I have been on a kick with these two chocolates lately. So, And I thought originally, I swear she told somebody that they were three for five. So we both bought a whole bunch and... Um, and then she said, no, they're $3 each for the big bags. So I was a little mad because I wouldn't have probably got as much as I did had I have known that. I mean, it's still a decent deal, but uh, look at these. They had Starburst lollipops. So I thought that was really kind of cool. So me and my mom both got one of those, and we thought we'd try those. So yeah, there's Starburst lollipops. Just got the uh, Krabby Patties, like I said, Milky's Butterfingers that I already dug into, and the, I got another Milky Way, and then I got um, a Swedish Fish and Sour Patch Kids one. <laughs> so, just some candy. Like I said, I thought they were three for five, or, yeah. Three for five. So that's why I grabbed so many at first. And then she said they were three bucks each, which I mean, it's not horrible, but it's not the greatest price. So, and she would not go down. This little guy was 50 cents, and I just thought he was cute. I actually gave the lady a dollar for him because he was brand new with tags. Just a little Santa elf little gray elf she had all this like these baskets of stuff and she said it's all two for a dollar so it was 50 cents but I'm like here I couldn't find anything else I really wanted or needed <laughs> so it just bought the little Santa and he's got like the little beans in his butt so he sits on a table and he's cute though he's cute all right. Oh, God, that scared the crap out of me. It's a cockroach in that basket. <laughs> All right, next, I got this shirt, which is so my mother. If this was in her size, she would have bought this in a second. But I thought it was actually, like, a really nice shirt for when I start working again and everything. I just thought it was a really, like, dressy, cute work shirt. So, and I need some new ones, so. I did buy that. I don't know why, but this cat in the hat ornament was just so cute and it was 50 cents. So I said, you know what, I'm getting it. It's got a little bell in it. So I got the little cat in the hat ornament. He was adorable. Oh, this is my mom's. I forgot to give it to her. So she bought this brand new mascara. The lady said her daughter works for like a big makeup company, so she has all this brand new makeup. She said it's never been used, it's just been opened. Um, so it's by Per Fully Charged Mascara Powered by Magnetic Technology. So we'll see. I'm gonna try it before I give it back to my mother. So we'll see how it, how good it is. <coughs> All right, let's see what else we got in here. Oh, I was kind of disappointed. So I did buy some disinfecting wipes. These were a dollar for a big bag, so I bought those. <coughs> I got my daughter some highlighters for a buck. Because she just wanted to steal mine the other day. And I let her, but I thought these were cute for a buck. So I bought them for her. And then, I don't know if these are any good, but they were a dollar, so I bought these little fishing hooks for my husband. Thought maybe I could throw it in his, like, stocking or something. Um, <clears throat> so, it does say they are stuffed with real shrimp. I don't know how old they are. Like, I know they're brand new in the package. It does say for fresh or salt water. 
extra sharp hook, so maybe he could try these. But I figured for a buck, why not, as a little stocking stuffer. And then I just got a pack of spearmint gum for a buck as well. <coughs> Sorry, guys. That was honestly just probably a little junk that I didn't really need. That freaking roach in this laundry basket. My mom bought this laundry basket. is disgusting, honestly. Freaking me out. Um, so I had bought in some iPhone chargers there because they are, what are they? I think they're, they're $3 each there or they're two for five. So I bought two. My mom got one. I should have probably got three and just did the, two, you know, the four for five, um, <laughs> or the four for 10, but I was like, well, I only need two. So because um, I needed a new one for my car and then I just bought us another one just to have so last time I bought um, like I said my son his the iPhone chargers because they're the same price are three dollars or two for five which is a great deal for an iPhone charger and for a regular charger that are I think they are 10 or 12 feet long I don't know they're very very long though which is great so yeah, I got two of those. Oh, shoot. I didn't even realize this one is an iPhone charger. Somebody must have stuck it in there on accident. Well, that stinks. Darn it. Oh, well. Well, my son's got another one if he needs it. Or my daughter. They get blue. I got pink, at least. Alright, let's see what else. And then, okay, I gotta get this bug out of here. It's grossing me out. I saw this shirt for, I think I paid two bucks for it. I'm pretty sure. It is actually really, really soft. So I got this for my older son. It's just a Popeye shirt, but I thought it was really cute. And like I said, it's really, really soft for two bucks. So I thought it was cute. There's still more. Y'all should see my house. My husband's gonna kill me because, like, I just have so much shit. Ooh, can't say that. So much stuff everywhere <laughs> in my house. All right. So next, these I actually got last week, and like I said, I didn't do a haul last week because I didn't get a lot. So um, I mainly just got the suitcases. So. I really didn't have much to show you guys, so. But I did get these last week. I think I paid a dollar for these, honestly. Um, they are size eight. I just thought they were cute. Again, I could wear these to like work and things like that. Like they would be really pretty with that shirt and stuff. So for a buck, I said, why not? <coughs> All right, then now is the best part because it's all the free stuff this guy had a pile on the floor i don't know there might be other stuff in here but me and my mother went through all the boxes yeah there's some other stuff in here but me and my mother went through all these boxes he had probably like five boxes and he said everything on the ground is free so we dug through that so i will get to that in a minute though all right next I bought this little outfit. I'm not crazy about the material or the color, but I thought it was cute, so it's just this romper, and it's half sleeves. I don't know. I don't like this color, personally. Like, it's like that orangish red color, and I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to like it. I guess we'll see when I put it on, if it even fits. But I think I paid... It was either a dollar or two dollars. It's not much at all. Then I got these little white shorts for me or my daughter because I really liked them. <clears throat> and they're Amber Crombie and Fitch. I think I actually paid, I think they were a dollar. I think, yeah. No, these were, these were both a dollar. So I remember she said, yeah, most of them are a dollar except for like one or two pieces. 
So I just got these cute little comfortable Amber Crombie and Fitch white shorts. They're really cute. <clears throat> and then this is two, bit, two bucks. It was a little dirty, but I figured I could wash it because I've washed other bags in the washing machine and it actually works. And you can tend to get out the stains. This one, I don't know though, because I didn't even look at the straps. But hopefully, <clears throat> I think I'll still be able to wash it. If not, I could just take a sponge and some soap and water and clean the top part of it because it is a little dirty up top. But otherwise, it's really cute. So it's just this black and white and pink. It's got little pink hearts on it. Um, Victoria's Secret bag. So we got that as well. And that was that was two bucks and the clothes were a dollar. Alright. Next, these were all a dollar as well. I wanted to try this to like clean my windows and stuff. I don't know how well it's gonna work, but it was a dollar. And I kind of really liked it. So it's got like this. The window cleaner squeegee whatever whatever you call this I don't know if that's the name for it but it's got the little squeegee thing and then it's actually got a little um, plastic tube here and you untwist the bottom and fill it with whatever you want to put in it window cleaner Windex whatever and it's got a spray here too so you can take the cap off spray it and clean your windows I think it's just so cute. I really do. I really liked it. I also got this leather duffel bag. If you haven't noticed, I'm obsessed with bags, purses, duffel bags, all that. Oh, so this is from um, Saks Fifth Avenue. So this is actually an expensive bag, and it's huge. So it's a blue suede one. It's really, really big. That was nice for a dollar. And it also has the little change purse in here. Oh, the, and this change purse doesn't go with it because the change purse is a coach change purse. Which is pretty cool. I didn't even know that that was attached to it. And then I got this little bag because I just thought it was cute. And it's got a little snap and just a little pocket. I thought, you know, I don't even know what you could put in here. You could use this as like a little wallet or something, but I just thought it was really pretty. So for a buck, I got that. All right, so see, I forgot to give my mom one of my stepdad's shirts. Oops, okay. We're almost to the free stuff. This purse, oh wait. Okay, so this is what I wanted to tell you guys about. So I went to this lady's stand and she had these cute little pink nails. So I got these for a dollar, so pretty. And um, when I was checking out or whatever you wanna call it, she's like, oh yeah. She's like, I had a ton of fake nails earlier. She goes, these young girls came and bought them all up because she's like, you know, they were only, I was only asking a dollar and they're like eight, ten, ten bucks in the store. And I'm like, uh, yeah, I'm like, oh, I wish I would have seen them before because she probably had some really good ones. But this was the only one left that I saw. Well, there were like two other ones, but I didn't like them. So they were super pretty. They're just a light pink, but I liked them, so... And then I got these, she gave me these two sprays, she said you can have them both for a dollar. So I just wanted the uh, Vanilla Snowflake one, they're body mist, but I'll probably just honestly use them more as like air fresheners. But I love vanilla, and then this one's winter berry, so I figured I'd take them both for a dollar. But I originally just wanted this one, but she's like, you can have them both for a dollar, so I'm like, okay. Sounds good to me. And then the last thing that I think, I think this is the last thing I bought. But I got this little adorable gray purse. So cute for five bucks. 
and it's got a little wallet with it which is just adorable as well isn't that so cute and then it comes also with the long strap it was brand new and it was really really cute so I just thought that was adorable for five bucks so I got it. I love the size. I love the little color of it. And it's brand new. So it's cute. Cute little purse. I can't help it. I can't help buying purses and bags. They're just my thing. We all have our things, but that is my big thing. Alright, y'all. Now we're going to the free stuff. <clears throat> oh, so this guy, he had so so many cute shoes, honestly, for free in that pile. I didn't even see that these were broke, or maybe they just broke now. Um, so many shoes, but they were all way too big. They were all size 10 and 11s. So, and I were between a 7 to an 8, and so does my daughter. So, but I did see these ones. I didn't realize that the chain was broke, or maybe it might have just broke because I don't. I don't, I think I would have saw that it was broke before, so I just got these little wedged with the little chain for free. I don't even know what size they are, honestly. They are by Olivia and Kate, so I did get those. <clears throat> no, I guess they're both kind of broke. Oh, well. They were free. Like I said, they were free, so. He also gave me, like, one of those free, uh, big Tupperware bins. Which, uh, I'll show you guys at the end. So this is a shirt my mother got for my stepdad. I don't know what she paid for this. But I forgot to give it to her, so. I'll take it over to her next time I go see her. Alright, so this is all free. So I got this little black hat for my boys. Figured one of them might like it to wear. I don't know. I just basically grabbed it all and I'm like, I can sort through it later. These are a size 30, so I don't really know. I was thinking for my older son because he's really tiny, but I think these are going to be way too big on him. And they're going to be too small for my husband and my other son, so so we'll just have to see. But they are um, Airwalk, and they're really nice, like just uh, khaki corduroy jeans, or corduroy, corduroy shorts <laughs> with nice pockets and stuff. And I thought for free, why not grab them? So, I grabbed this for my son. I didn't see the bleach stains on it, though. It's got a little bit of bleach stains, which kind of sucks, because I really liked this one for him. It just has little skulls on it, which is black and gray, but you can see the bleach stains on the pocket. Oh, well. Like I said, it was free, so... Can't beat free. I just grabbed this little black tank top. I figured why not. Just a black tank top. <clears throat> Next, I got this for one of my boys. And it's kind of pretty. I like it. I, lo I love the, the like, um, not tie dye. Well, I guess kind of like a neon tie dye thing. So I thought that was kind of cool for on a cooler day if it ever if we ever get a cooler day um my mom threw the sweater in for me it's a little bit big but I might wear it it's cute it's just a blue and white sweater again this is all free so why the heck not grab it grab it all pretty much and then decide when I get home but this like little fleece is black or didn't buy. I got it for free. It's a little fleece black zip up sweatshirt. <clears throat> Hang on. 
I'm moving the stuff I showed you to one side and the other stuff on the other side. Alright, so let's do this one next. I don't even know what this one says. Live, love, move, and groove on the back. And it's just the hoodie with this neon zipper, just black hoodie. And these were kind of ugly, but <laughs> again, they were free, so I figured maybe my son will wear them. I don't know. I guess they're not that bad. They're just short, so maybe with a black shirt or something, they might look okay. And then I grabbed these ones, too. I don't even know why, but I got these ones, too. Then... Well, I know why, because it was all free. I got these, like, swishy pants for one of my boys. So if it gets a little cooler out, it's got the little halfway zipper. I'm just going to whip through these, because I know clothes are kind of boring. They did have this Rick and Morty shirt. I was so disappointed, though. Somebody, like, cut a triangle in the top, so now it kind of looks like a girl shirt. But again, it was free, so I figured... Why not try it? You could actually wear that like just around the house or something if you wanted to. I got another black tank top. These were free as well. So this one's a Michael Kors, just black t-shirt for my son. For free. Michael Kors t-shirt for free. Great deal. And then I got, we're almost done guys, this American Eagle one. I don't know why somebody decided to cut all the top parts. Why did they do that? Oh, hang on. No. I didn't realize that on this one. My mom threw this one in. But it's a large, just American Eagle shirt. That stinks though. I also got this. This is perfect for when I travel and stuff. I am always like, I always straighten my hair like last when I'm getting ready and stuff. So like when I'm traveling and I always bring my straightener when we go on trips and stuff and it's always too hot to throw in my bag. So I was like, I think this would work and be kind of perfect to throw my straightener in. I don't know if it'll burn this material. I'll have to look. But, I mean, it was for a hair tool. So, and it's got a little pocket in the back. So, you can put your brush back here or whatever. And your straightener in here. Or some hair clips or whatever. But I thought this was really nice for for traveling to put, to put things in. I really liked that. I thought it was going to be perfect, like I said, for my straightener especially starting to get hot. Alright, we're almost done. Almost done, y'all. Uh-oh. I hope we didn't drop it again. Um, these were in the free bin. My mom's like, just grab them. They're just pillowcases. Black and white little pillowcases. But they're nice. There's two of them. So we grabbed those. These, I didn't even look at what size they were or anything like that. Honestly, I just threw them in. So we got this little, this is big. Well, it's not big, but it's a little big for me. But it's pretty. For your, whatever I don't end up wearing or using, I'll give it to Goodwill. Then I grabbed this one with the rhinestones. It's pretty too. Again, well, this one's not as big. And that's an extra large, so it's a little big. And then I just got these um, leggings with the holes on the sides for free as well. And there was another shirt, and that was like the best one. And I don't know where it is. It, and it literally it fell out of our carts. 
or our wagon we brought a wagon we always bring a wagon or a cart to the flea market and it fell out and this lady when we were leaving and this lady said oh ladies you you guys dropped something and we're like oh thank you so much so i went back to get it but now i don't see it so i'm wondering if it fell out yet again no because oh i know where it is so i also grabbed this um they had this like wicker uh stool but it's like pretty heavy and it's a pretty nice one um i can show you guys if you guys want to see it um it's in our trunk honestly so but i mean it's it's like it's it's fine it just needs to be spray painted so that's what i plan on doing i'm planning on spray painting it and then putting it in my living room as like a footstool or something like that so i remember my mom threw the shirt in there but i put that in the trunk and i thought i threw the shirt in the back seat so i'm gonna have to go look at that and get back to you guys with that one but I think it was just, I'm not positive, but I think it was just a black t-shirt with um, like gold or silver rhinestones um, that said Calvin Klein on it. So, all right guys, well, that is it for today. If you guys want to see, like I said, the other um, shirt and the wicker stool, let me know in the comments. Maybe I'll show it in my next video that I do. Otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure if you would like to, I would really greatly appreciate it though. If you would like, please hit that subscribe button and hit that like button. And again, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.